the utility industry technologies are more mature, right? They're advancing on a more incremental basis, so it makes sense to have a long-term utility plan with a lot of detail out 20 or 30 years. But a lot of the technologies to reduce greenhouse gases are still emerging, still developing. And so it, it makes sense to have some specificity in the near term, but beyond 10 years, you want to build in some placeholders, some flexibility. You want to be able to take advantage of those technologies that maybe aren't viable today, but that will be 10 years from now. And really, it's just a discussion. You sit down with the group, because the students really are typically pretty uh, excited and energized about getting from point A to point B discreetly, but you have to explain to them, well, if we did that 10 years ago, maybe LED bulbs, you know, LED lighting, and some of the technologies that are viable today wouldn't have been on the table. Because one of the problems you have with a, a plan that's very specific is, you know, 10 years from now, you're gonna have people who wanna stick to the plan because it's the plan. All right, so you want to build in some flexibility and have some placeholders that, that allow you to leverage advances in technology.